Okay. Let's start the game up. And fade over. Stream jar keeping me updated. Like always. I really want that box off the screen. Oop. I'm having trouble on my control monitor. There we go. We beat that really long mission last time. And I believe it sounds like an escort mission this next time. And this is really loud in my ears. Escort. That doesn't fill me with hope. Two civilian aircraft flying through the hills region northwest of Los Canas are under threat of attack by Erujian fighters. On board are the engineers responsible for Stonehenge, as well as their families. They are offering information in exchange for amnesty and permission to defect to an ISAF member state. One of the aircraft is flying at an extremely low altitude due to some unknown problem. Your mission is to protect both aircraft from enemy fighters. Make sure they exit the combat area safely. Hmm. Well, this could be more fun. Okay. Let's see, what can I buy? Ooh, look at that stealth bomber. I think I'd like this new aeroplane. What weapons can I buy for it? Really, I can buy the unguided bomb for it. That's interesting. Let's save real quick. Uh, actually, no. I might want to reload in case I don't like this plane. What does it come with? Ooh, hey, look at that. I like that. Wrong button. Ericsium, this is Sky Eye. Please describe your situation. Ericsium, Flight 702 here. Erosian fighters are closing in on us at 23,000 feet. Please hurry. Flight 701 here. We were shot on takeoff and our captain's injured. This is First Officer Nagase. 10 4, an escort is inbound. Both aircraft maintain your course. On it, guys. Come on. You're losing too much fuel. Mobius one, there's another bandit closing in on flight 701 at 6,000 feet. Flight 701, can you raise altitude? This will assist the ISAF escort. Negative. We cannot maintain cabin pressure if we climb. Really shooting at me, huh?
Let's see, third try is a charm. There we go. Oh, there's three of them this time, though. Boy, it's really hard to see this high up. It'd be nice if I wasn't, but what are you going to do? Okay, let's get in. Okay. I did. It took a few missiles, but I did it. There we go. This is Air Ixian Flight 701. We're carrying civilians. Don't shoot! They're not gonna listen. They're bad airplanes. That wasn't that bad. Mobius One, Sky Eye here. Both aircraft have exited the combat area safely. There were no losses. The mission was a success. Sky Eye, this is Flight 701. All passengers and crew from both aircraft were examined by an ISAF. That wasn't that bad. And are in good I'm health. happy with that. Several states are coming forward with offers of amnesty to the defectors and their families. Let's save. I'm happy with that airplane. Bombs were delivered to their base. This meant that an enemy who had to be fought by those means was close at hand. The resistance blew up the squadron's runway. Yellow 4 suffered light shrapnel wounds. Though the runway could be fixed, the complete loss of reserve supplies was a heavy blow. Logistics support became infrequent following the Allied operations. I knew this because Yellow Squadron's crew chief belly ached about this all the time to me. I won't complain if I buy the farm while I'm airborne, but I can't stand being taken out while I'm grounded. Now I understand 13's feelings. Reports of the Stonehenge air raid came in. 
yellow floor of the Atlantis. With no bombs, her plane was flying. But her plane was in bad shape. It needed an engine replacement badly. We will attack Stonehenge, the lethal weapon that has plagued ISAF for so long. Since it was designed to shoot down asteroids, a few small fighters flying unpredictable high-speed courses should be able to get within range. According to the defectors, its central ECM jamming system disrupts our radar and missile guidance systems. Unless this system is destroyed, our mission will be very difficult to execute. HQ predicts a 40% casualty rate for all deployed aircraft. It will be a tough mission, but what we can avoid. Now go and reclaim the skies over the mainland. Dismissed. Okay. We do got ground targets, so I don't want to use this plane. I can use that last plane. This is just storing targets list. That's not a big deal to me. Although this makes it look like it could be difficult. What am I shooting at? Destroy. 
That's why I wasn't. Okay, now what? Target destroyed. I repeat, Mobius One has destroyed the target. Boy! Yahoo! Okay, tell me what it is. Okay, I'll do that once I change my missiles out. Yes, I do need to return the carrier. Boy, it takes a while to get over here. Mobius one. Yeah. Change weapon. Air, air. Take off. Mobius one, you are cleared for takeoff. Boy, are we just doing tumble fights with each other here? Yeah, I know. Hard enemy radar spike. Mobius one, bandit behind you. He's all mine. Stonehenge gone. What could they be after? Missile shot trashed. Missile, missile. Right behind him. Missile, hard left. Hard enemy 
radar spike. Wow, this sucks. There we go. Good thing I reloaded. Shit. mission am I on? Though he lost four, Thirteen never openly showed his sorrow. But I found out. He was alone, quietly gazing at the handkerchief Yellow Four left behind. When he felt my eyes upon him, he said, no matter what, she can't complain. She went up with her plane in disrepair. Pilots are responsible for their planes. He then went on and spoke of the time when they first met. He spoke of when she was just a girl, before he trained her, before she became a fighter pilot. His words weren't directed at me in particular. He was keeping a precious memory alive by speaking those words. The hint of perfume on her keepsake handkerchief. Yellow Squadron's pilot turnover ran high. The skilled ones went in to shore up other units while rookies with little airtime transferred in. Yellow 13 posted an allied paper faxed over by headquarters. It praised the pilot who destroyed Stonehenge. 13 said to everyone, Look, here's something worthy of praise. Even among the enemy there are men like this. Not all of them are despicable bastards who rob our wings through cowardly sabotage. I stared at the barkeep's daughter as she winced at those words. The allies were coming to our town. Am I the bad guy in the story? So I sure feel like I am now. Okay, I think they're like 24 missions, so I'm getting there. A returning U2 recon plane with engine trouble is currently passing through Null Ravine due to its inability to climb to higher altitudes. However, airship mounted noise jammers in the area are preventing the use of radar. At this rate, a crash is very likely. Destroy as many jammers in the valley as possible and get that recon plane safely. Okay. Radar won't work, so you'll need to find the airships visually and destroy them with your machine guns. Oh. That doesn't sound great. No, I don't care about aircraft or about guns. What new are there any new airplanes I can buy? Seems like a really good airplane. The stability isn't good though. I'll stick with what I got for now. We'll try it out. I don't know, stability is about the same. Let's sell this airplane, I think. 
I can always reload. Do I lose? Well, okay, I don't need to see this again. So when I sell an airplane, I don't sell its weapons first. Am I losing money? Let's try it. I think I am. Okay, but I don't have enough. So we're gonna load one more time and we'll just deal with what we got. We're gonna try it. Uh, I can't use them yet, but. Here's an airship jamming device. There are others as well. Destroy them all. working on it. Isaac will handle the jammers. Maintain your course and we'll get you home safe. Roger, we're in your hands. Okay, there's one. Not even my thing that says I'm in gun range works, so that's interesting. At least they're not moving targets. I'm okay with that. I did miss one back here. Get five more. I sure haven't seen one in a while. Am I too high? Or maybe even too low?
they doing with their camps? Okay. I just don't know where they are. There's one. I'm going way too fast. Did this pass one? Mobius one, recon aircraft will transit soon. Radar is still blacked out. Hurry, six miles. Okay, I just saw a second one. Radar noise interference is leveling off. The reconnaissance aircraft should be able to get through soon. Okay. Yeah, I know. I got the 1300 that I needed. We'll be able to get one or two more for you, dude. You're not the only one going to crash because of them.
I got this guy on me. Hard enemy radar spike. Oh, this guy's gonna. I need to heal up. Let's see if I can't take a couple of them with these multi-target ones. Easy peasy. Mobius one, recon aircraft is secure. Mission is complete. Method here, thanks for the escort, fighter. You made this reconnaissance mission a success. One more mission? I think we can do one more attempt at least. The recon plane brought back data on Megalith. This is the super weapon designed by the Erusions to replace Stonehenge. Analysis by the intelligent unit leads to the conclusion that victory hinges on ending this war before Megalith is deployed. Save and we'll get that much better plane. Okay. That sounds like something I can do. Can I sell the weapons for this first airplane? Because I'm not going to... I don't have any. What 
sell the airplane itself. This seems like a very good airplane. I need to get this airplane. What weapons does it come with? Oh, good. Oh, no, it doesn't come with those. save a second file just in case. Just in case that was a mistake. I don't think it will be. Mobius 1, a wire from the Northern Landing Forces. We're depending on your efforts. Commence this is a cool looking plane. Weird that missiles can somehow juke my my shots. Really? Why are they flying like this? The target split into two. Mobius one shot down a target. Sixty miles and closing. Yeah, I think I made a mistake here. I need those spread missiles. Real fast, though. Obvious one destroyed the target. Target down. Obvious one shot down a target. One destroyed the target. Forty miles and closing. Okay, let's get there. Come on. Shot down a target. 
Are cruise missiles like piloted missiles? Can they steer? Well done. Mobius one, another aircraft has been sighted. That's strange. There's only one. The cruise missile is heading south along the glacier. Looks like a regular warhead, but keep your distance. Yeah, there's gonna be something dumb about this missile, isn't there? Why has this missile got juke? I think that's going to be it. Good job. There was no unnecessary loss of landing troops, and the northern coast is now secure. As the Allies advanced, the retreating erosion forces from the east filled our town. The AA gun crew set up their positions atop the hospital, and Yellow 13 smoldered with quiet anger over their tactics. Nights were long, with the town's mandatory blackouts. The barkeep's daughter tried to plant laser transmitters for detonating explosives. She got caught. It was Yellow 13. He knew she was responsible for planting the bomb on their runway as well. The face of the enemy whom he hated belonged to someone close to him. Get out of our town, you fascist pig. Those were the words from my mouth. I've never seen his face twist so painfully. Do you hate us that much? We couldn't shake or nod our heads in reply.
It seemed like an eternity passed before he said go and released us. The next day, there was no change in his attitude. As usual, he made his requests to the squadron crew chief. The poor fuel quality is affecting thrust. As soon as the Allied forces drew near, the resistance would end the blackouts over the city. Okay, well, I'm trying to get the decision wheel working, but it's a Windows, it's a Windows Store app, so it's a piece of garbage. Let's see if I can't hack it a little bit here. That's still not going to work. This will work, though. Let me save real quick. Decision wheel up. Get it in the right spot on screen. Is reversed for some reason. There we go. Okay, we gotta get rid of... Boy, this app is a piece of shit. But, okay. I'm gonna move my mic. Ooh, pleasant sounds all around. Hi. Okay, let's decide. So, random stream is going to be later today instead of tomorrow. Because I'm gone all the rest of the week. Uh, so yeah, let's see what, we're, what I have to install or set up very, very quickly. Spin. Why is it on the bottom? Okay, I'm playing Gex 3 for the PS... Ooh, let's see. Okay. Okay, we'll try it. I'm not sure how I'll set up the PS1. But, uh, just for... First off, I want to... I don't know why this is so fucked up. Flip vertical too. No, not that. Not that, you piece of shit. The wheel. Flip the wheel vertical. And then horizontal again. And then move it over the circle so that you can't see through it. Um, so I'm going to just spin it once more, just as a backup. It's Gex 3, but if I can't get it to work, it is not a hard game, not a hard game, not a hard game to set up. Star Tropics, which probably is easier to set up. But yeah, I'm going to try for Gex 3. Um, in case you don't watch that, like I just said, no more streams for the rest of the week until Sunday, which is a little up in the air right now. Um... But I think that's all the news I have for the week. Uh, if you like this, go down below and check out the Patreon or up in the upper right if you're on the YouTube. Uh, we are at the point where I can give free games out soon. So get on that if you want to get in on that. Or help me make it so I can do other cool stuff too. But yeah, until... Either random stream later or next time you catch us. This is Mike with GameKiwi. Thanks for watching and as always, keep it juicy.